Okay, in this video, I'm going to discuss a few problems that can occur in Photoshop that indicates the preferences file of Photoshop is damaged and needs to be deleted. Okay, uh, the first uh, first problem you could possibly run into is with index separations. Here we have a basic index separation has an underbase white, a few colors, and a black. Now, if you're running index separations and they're coming out like this where you only, your under base is correct, your black channel is correct, but all your other colors are blank and void. This would indicate that the preferences of Photoshop is damaged. Another indicator would be errors such as this when running ultracepts. If you receive a runtime error 216, followed by an error that you could not lo load the uh, quick license runtime DLL. This would also indicate the preferences is damaged. In this case, it's a Windows 8.1 issue, as Photoshop's preferences file has been known uh, to be damaged by Windows 8.1 and needs to be reset. Now I'm going to show you how to do it, and the best way to reset preferences is to actually physically delete the file. Now let me minimize Photoshop here, and uh, what we'll need to do first is go to control panel on your Windows computer and you're going to want to click appearance and personalization okay when that uh, opens you're going to click folder options when the folder options window opens click the view button and we want to make sure the radio button for show hidden files folders and drives is selected uh, because the folder that your Photoshop preferences file is contained in is a hidden folder so you'll need to click this uh, then click apply and then click OK at that point you can close your uh, control panel now you would want to open up your C drive and you want to scroll down and double click users uh, select your username on the computer and then you'll want to open up the app data folder and then you want to click the roaming folder then open the Adobe folder inside Adobe you're going to want to open Adobe Photoshop CS6 or whatever version you happen to have installed on your system in there you want to open up the folder that says Adobe Photoshop settings in this case it's CS6 settings and inside the settings your preferences file will be called Adobe Photoshop CS6 or whatever version prefs and Adobe Photoshop X64 uh, whatever version prefs it's quite possible that you do have two uh, copies of the preferences file if you have a 64-bit system uh, but any file in here with the name prefs after it needs to be deleted so simply delete these two files and restart Photoshop Photoshop will then generate a brand new preferences file uh, for itself and those errors will now disappear. And that's how you reset the preferences file in uh, all versions of Adobe Photoshop on Windows.